The big game, of course, is tomorrow. If you have not planned your menu yet, consider this the two-minute warning. Here to help, David Burke, chef, entrepreneur, and author of one of America's true cooking trailblazers. Just this week, David opened his latest venture, David Burke Kitchen in the James, New York. As our Super Bowl chef in a shoestring, we gave him 80 bucks, that's double our usual budget, to create the ultimate game day menu. David, hey, it is great to see you. Thanks nice for coming in. You. Appreciate it. What is on the menu today? A lot oh, of stuff. A lot of stuff. A lot of snack food, finger food, uh, shrimp dumplings. I'll show you how to make those. Very simple. Okay. But kind of gourmet for Super Bowl. All right. Uh, there's prosciutto wrapped asparagus that are baked with parmesan. Mm -hmm. Traditional sliders, which everybody loves. Chicken wings done with a little bit Asian style sauce. Tacos with uh, barbecue salmon, barbecued beef, which I'm going to demo also. But we'll start with ah, dumplings. Not enough food here. Chicken, chicken chili, I think it's. And chicken well. chili also. Okay, great. Way All down right. the end. All right, shrimp. shrimp. Uh, these are about um, these are one ounce shrimp beets. So we got mm -hmm. almost a pound here. Yeah. Shrimp and butter. Just a little, a little bit. bit of butter. A little bit. Oh, I'm not going to eat all. <laughs> all right. That's not that much. Okay. <laughs> Twenty-four dumplings. Uh huh. And that gets pureed very simply. And that's it. Okay. We're done with this part. I'm going to hand you that with. Great, great, great. Um, wonton skins. You can buy these in most supermarkets. Mm -hmm. I'm going to put a little bit of chive in there. Okay, and that was very bit simple. Lemon. This is, you know, you lemon zest, that. salt and pepper. This is pretty simple. Right. And again, it, these can be done ahead of time. Okay. The next step is this. Uh, spoon out a little bit. Okay. And again, you can add soy sauce and, uh -huh. and barbecue sauce to this for more flavor. This is intimidating to a lot of folks. This yeah, but you thing. know what? It's really delicate. not. It's, you can do this like shrimp toast. You can spread this on bread mm -hmm. and saute it like, and make a grilled cheese sandwich with All this right. filling. So this, this gets uh, pinched up uh -huh. like this, and you got a little dumpling. Oh, great. Okay. Now, what I've done is here is I put the shrimp tail in it, and that's ah, just for a more advanced exactly. version. But again, this works fine. As is, that's like dim sum. Okay. And you'll see here. How long they are they boil? These? these are two, three minutes. Uh -huh. Not a lot, not a lot. Gotcha. And again, these can be, these are good at room temp. And it, and, it, and it looks it looks a lot fancier than it really is. I mean, that took about a minute. I know I'm a, I'm a professional. You are a professional, but, yes. <laughs> it's, uh, <laughs> just, that's, uh, so those are dumplings. You, you display them with a little barbecue sauce. Uh -huh. uh, another idea, and I use this a lot for snack food, is pancakes. Okay. So we've got a kind of like, like a Peking duck thing you're going to do. Yes. Here. This is this is basic right. pancake batter from a uh, from a from a, a, a box. Mm -hmm. um, you can make your box own. Box with a woman on the no, no yep. names you mentioned. Here. Okay. Gotcha. <laughs> uh, Woman's picture on the box. All right. And you've got I put barbecue sauce. I put in a little bit of chives, some horseradish. So I'm making a, a batter. This is our pancake batter. So okay. it's got barbecue sauce and more flavor. Uh -huh. You don't see that often, barbecue sauce and, and no. Well, you batter. know, we're making it. We're making a. We're not making a breakfast pancake. Right. We're making something that's more like a snack and order. Again, okay. you can do this with cheese. Mm -hmm. So there's the idea. And again, these pancakes, you can make 60 of them ahead of time. We come up with this. This is a eye round of beef mm -hmm. or flank steak. And you use this particular cut of beef because it's a little cheaper. All right. It's a little, little less expensive, and you're not looking for filet on a Super Bowl. I mean, you could. Right. But we're on a shoe. We're street. on a budget here. We're, right. we're on a budget. Exactly. Um, and these basically cook at the same time. The idea is you get this color pancake, very nice. Uh -huh. Got a piece of beef, which you're gonna pull ah. off the stick. And then you're gonna add my sauce. Right. My sauce. The sauce. There you go. Oh, okay. It's looking at me like yeah, I took the, the sauce. sauce. Yeah. I didn't, I didn't <laughs> take it. The sauce, Ross. Well, yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> the sauce, Ross. So there you go. Now you've got what you call. Oh, a style of Peking duck. Ooh, okay. I'm so it's easy to eat in front of a TV. All right. Not too messy in the house. Okay. Not enough food here, but what's next? <laughs> <laughs> the um, the sauce, though, for instance, oh. is very simple for home. I took... <laughs> Chip, thanks for taking the close-up uh, on that. Great. Great. <laughs> well, very good. that's flank steak. Flank steak has a little more chew to it. So, you know, the sauce is made with ketchup... Tabasco and Worcestershire sauce. Very simple. Okay. Otherwise, you can use a barbecue sauce. <clears throat> what I've done over here is we've presented it on the uh, on the steak itself mm. as as a piece that's been uh, actually could be used for backup. Okay. So if you do run out, you've got you've got the beef to slice. Okay. Salmon tacos, simple barbecued. Mm -hmm. 
chicken wings with uh, done instead of buffalo style, they're done with soy sauce and ginger, a little bit of honey, of Chef course, Dave, chili. We guys, come in on, in on this action. In, it looks guys. delicious. Okay. Uh, it smells delicious. All good hey, stuff. Good to see you. All Thanks good for picking this. Nice to see you. Oh, nice. the chicken chili over there. The yeah, chicken stuff, chili. The sliders stuff. are always, uh, you know, yeah. the small versions of, of a classic hamburger. Okay. We want to take a look at the, the cost breakdown. See what see what you did here. Our budget was eighty bucks. Let's see how you did. I think we did okay. You, you think so? Here we I go. Stop at the register. Seventy-seven dollars and sixty-four cents. Yes, you came in under budget. All yeah. this food. Yeah, you know what? It's just smart shopping, and it's small quantities. Mm -hmm. You know, there's 24 pieces of each item, eight items. That's usually enough to get through a game. Gotcha. And by the way, folks, so you can find these super recipes at cbsnews.com slash Saturday. Wow. Good stuff. Tastes hey, delicious. Yeah. Delicious. Congrats again Thank you. on the new restaurant. Appreciate it. And thanks for coming in. Chef Thank you very much.